a triathlete with Ari so I'm excited but also a little skeptical we've got a very big day for me including um, swimming which I hate but uh, I think it's gonna be fun and everyone's always telling me you should switch to triathlon you should try triathlon so I'm trying it today we'll see how it goes and I'm probably not switching but maybe I fall in love with it we'll just have to see all right, met up with the man himself, professional triathlete among us. Hey. Yeah, his goggles are decent, but not as nice as mine. I hate swimming, so I never do it, but you know, it's part of triathlon, so today we're doing it. And Ari thinks I'm gonna die. My only goal is to not do that, so. Okay, we are at the lake. Ari's doing some warm-up exercises with his arm. Yeah, Makes me think I need to do this as well, so I'm swinging my arm too. It's good to loosen up the shoulders. I'm loosening up. <laughs> I'm gonna try to swim across and back. Yeah, so 3K swim. Anyways, Ari, you uh, you have any words here? Uh, stay relaxed. It gets pretty scary out there in the middle of the lake. It's very deep. There's like piranhas and sharks. All this you're saying is really keeping me relaxed, yeah. you know? Uh, swim. I'm just excited to get the swim done. Time to put the cap on. That's, you gotta get on Strava, Allie. I might download Strava one of these days. Maybe just for this. I'm only gonna put my swimming on Strava. I'll upload like three times a year. She's a swimmer. Alright. Give her a dunk. Oh yeah. Looking good. Maybe breathe a bit a bit more often. Oh. <gasps> I made it. We're at the dock on the other side of the lake. So we're halfway there? Yeah. How long did it take you? Um like 35 minutes. All right, so what are we thinking for the way back? How are you feeling about it? Uh, I'm hoping for quicker because on the way over, I definitely did like a few circles in the middle of the lake. Not purposefully, but it happened. So hopefully my spotting will be better on the way back and I can make it a little quicker. All right, let's not get hit by those guys. Shout out to Blue 70 for the safety swim buoy buddy. We love safety. Visibility, Yay. baby. Uh, swimming a bit, a bit diagonal there. Oh yeah, stop the watch. <laughs> she made it. Cross Green Lake and back. I don't think I got back faster than I went across. There's a little current coming back. Unfortunately. It took me 37 minutes to get back. Oh, so it would be all 70 minute swim. 72. <sighs> Satisfying feeling getting out of the water though. Oh yeah, that's what yes. I look forward to. How much of green like did you swallow? Because I swallowed a lot. Too much. I'd say there's at least <laughs> two or three goose dumps in my system at this oh, point. Oh yeah, you gotta learn how to keep it down. You know, along with along with the nutrition, the Just goose down. Some extra protein, some extra protein today. So. Yeah. How's the bod feeling? It's Ready okay. for a bike? Yeah, my arms are glad that their their work for the day is done. It's a little refuel, a little long transition, and then onto the bike. Ari is on his way over now for our bike. I'm nervous. I've never done like a block bike plus run workout combo, so see how it goes, but I'm all set up with my carbs. I've got these guys. Oh, Ari's here. And I've got this bottle with some in there. I'm also not good at like 
intra workout nutrition, my stomach usually gets upset. So we'll see how this goes, but whatever. Excited for it. And Ari, the man himself, is here now. Uh, lactate. Woo! Let's warm up. Okay. Yeah. They just finished 15 minute warm up, and now we're doing 20 minutes of LT1, which is like the lower end of threshold. No, no, no. It's the upper end of endurance. Okay. My heart rate during the warm up was like. 138 to 140. So now it's gonna be like 148 to 150, probably. So, yeah. Alright, we're about to get started on 12 times 4 minutes at LT2 slash threshold comfortably hard. I'd say. Breathing, but in control. By the end of the 12 reps, you should be like, yeah, I could do a few more. I could do three or four more for sure. I cannot imagine feeling like that at the end of 12 reps. Well, but too hard. I'll try to make it happen. How far in are you guys? We're on rep three of 12. Is it fun? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what it's time for? Lactate threshold testing. I don't know how to lactate test, so I'm just pacing around aimlessly. I was supposed to upload a video a week ago, guys, and I'm just so popular being a filmer that I just can't do it at this point. It's so tough being the it guy, you know? I just have this new friend I've been hanging out with. He's really cool. Less hard than Ari. Maybe I'm just more fit. Yeah, that could be it. session of the day 45 minute run off the bike with uh, 15 minutes chill then 30 minutes we'll probably go uh, around 610 610 pace but oh it's a gorgeous day out gorgeous day to be out here at Green Lake in my couple.com t-shirt
Six flat pins. Oh, that sounds terrible. Six, ten, six, ten. Oh, that's easy. No problem. Alright, Ali, how's how you feeling? Okay, we just finished the run and it definitely got to me. Like aerobically, I was pretty fine, but my legs and my stomach were both so upset. Like I have never taken in that many carbs during a workout and it felt so tough, but um, it was fun. I mean, I have like so much respect for triathletes now. What they do is, so difficult and I mean it's just a grind all the time but I did enjoy it like I feel so satisfied right now like I just ran a marathon and yeah my stomach is not satisfied but that's fine so recap nice long swim LT1 swim in the morning Allie went what 72 minutes and then uh two hour bike with 48 minutes of threshold and then 45 minute run off the bike with 30 minutes LT1. That's a big, that's a big day to just do, but we all know that if anyone's just going to do that, it's, it's Allie. Um, we're actually uh, in, the, in the middle of a bit of a, a competition between us for who likes exercise more. Um, <clears throat> she's shaking her head, but... No, no, just you wait. Literally in one hour, you're gonna get that like ache settling into your legs and you're gonna get on the couch and you're gonna be like, oh, no. I wanna do that again next week. Don't get me wrong, like, I feel incredibly accomplished, but I also feel sick. It's disingenuous to call that a day in the life. That's one of the harder days in the life of a professional triathlete. And uh, Ali O just, she just hopped in and did it. Survived. Still alive. Uh, did not necessarily thrive the whole time, but I did survive. <laughs>